Hello everyone and welcome to Graveyard Keeper. What I wanted to discuss today was the standard of the graveyard and how to get yours up. This is something that is covered by a little tutorial screen in game, but only if you complete a particular quest that is kind of easy to miss as it doesn't get documented in your known NPCs screen where quests normally get documented. Essentially, Yorick asks you to exhume a corpse from the bottom right hand corner of the graveyard. It really doesn't matter which and then he asks you to toss it into the river. Even with this tutorial screen though, it doesn't cover everything and isn't the most clear, so here we are. Now, each corpse that you bury has a score that you see in the graveyard. These are all then added up to get your graveyard score. Now, each corpse has an amount of skulls, red and white ones. The red ones are negative, you'll start with the number of red skulls as a negative score, for example, negative two. The number of white skulls are the number of points that you'll get if you fill those with grave decorations, represented by the little green leaf symbols. Now essentially, you want to get more white ones to increase your potential score when you add the decoration, and less red ones, to start with no negative penalty. This doesn't make the hugest amount of sense, I'm sure, so example, you have four white skulls, and you put a plus five cross and grave fence, you're still only going to get four as a score have three red skulls and no white skulls and you can decorate it till the cows come home but you're only going to get negative three as a maximum. The ratio and number of skulls that each corpse comes with can be altered largely by your autopsy and surgical abilities. So blood and fat. These both remove one red skull and add one white skull. So if you want to bury the body, remove both of these straight away. Flesh. Now this removes one white skull. Bone. This has no effect, so remove it, don't remove it, knock yourself out. Skin. This removes one white skull and adds a red skull. Skull. This adds a red skull. Brain, heart and intestines. All three of these are random. They can do anything ranging from removing three red skulls through to removing two white skulls. Gambling time! Surgical wounds are a negative, so try to avoid racking these up. Of course, none of this really matters if you're burning the body, so if you want that haul of skin and flesh, go for it, but save your graveyard the hassle and just take the bodies down and burn them. This can all be altered with alchemy, but that's more of a later in the game kind of goal. Still, if you manage to start whipping up anything that'll help you, hint, gold injections are fun, then things become much easier to maintain highly scoring corpses. Hopefully that's helped you and your graveyard is now looking spick and span. Thank you so much for joining me today, and if you do want to leave a like on the video or subscribe to the channel, that would be lovely. Until next time, thank you and goodbye!